Hello everyone, uh, today I want to talk about uh, moving average deviations. On previous uh, video, we talked about moving averages and strategies, how to use them, and uh, you know, crossing points using two moving average or just one moving average. Anyway, on this video, I'm going to talk about moving average deviations. So uh, today I'm using uh, eToro pro charts uh, and we are looking at euro US dollar daily charts obviously if you use other platform for, uh, or if uh, you're using uh, trading view which is one of my favorites then uh, you just uh, search for uh, moving average deviation and apply to your chart um, here you should go to studies tool and look for moving average deviations. The window will pop up. Uh, you can change the period, but I'm going to leave it at preset, field close, moving average type, simple. Uh, yeah, I explained in my previous video. There are different formula to calculate the moving averages and all the exponential uh, times you go, etc. And you can say which one is better anyway. Uh, we are using simple moving average deviation today, so we'll leave it at the preset. Uh, this is points of percent. I'm gonna change it to percent, and the reason why is back in school, if you studied math anyway, uh, we remember the bell curve, and you know, the bell curve. Uh, it's very famous and it's based on percentage. So, um, most of the data will be staying closer to the center, uh, of the curve. Um, I explained that a bit more on the, uh, chart. Uh, yep, that's it. Create. I'm gonna make the screen a bit bigger so you can, uh, have a look. Uh, I choose two percent as the uh, most of the time the price uh, will remain in two percent of the uh, medium. So uh, yeah, let me add a line um, horizontal at two. Uh, Uh, we can also add another, sorry, another uh, line, for example, and uh, here. Okay. Um, moving average deviation shows the volatility of the market. As I said, most of the time, price remains in this two, between this uh, two to minus two. Uh, so anytime that, you know, it goes, uh, above or below. So we can say that we are in very worthwhile mark. And, uh, when it's very, uh, it's very close to the middle one, to the zero, sorry. Then you may expect a volatile market. So, um, so how to use this now? Uh, you can see here, uh, we have a very volatile market, so you can expect the reversals and you know, uh, lots of uh, ups and downs. So when the uh, indicator goes below, uh, goes above two, then you, you, you may look for a reversal. Then you can use other indicators. Um, to decide where to put the cell position here. Um, yeah, and here you can see again it goes down. Then uh, when it starts to go back, you uh, put the buy. But you know, most uh, patient um, traders, they just uh, use the signals in uh, the direction of the trend. 
I I don't uh, recommend I I I don't recommend uh, going against the trend anyway. But in volatile markets, a very good opportunity to just swing the trend and uh, get profit as much as you can. And yeah, as I said, you can see here it was a very quiet market, and you can expect a volatility soon. Um, let's just look at another uh, market, maybe I dollar US dollar. Yeah, okay. Um, here we go and add that to again here so we can have a look. Yep, we can see the two uh, the uh, two percent line. So as you can see here we have very volatile market. Then you can expect uh, reversal as well. So you go and put a buy signal, and after that, it goes up and up. Here, again, you can see it's volatile, so you think it's going to go back, but because you see the uptrend just already started, uh, then it's better to wait and go in the direction of the uh trend. So yep, uh that is very basic information to how set up and use the uh moving average deviation. Uh hopefully it helps you guys to just um make an assessment of the current market and you know just uh, apply your strategy and uh, uh, your knowledge. Okay, uh, any comment or question, please uh, don't hesitate to ask, just put it uh, down below in the comments and I try my best to come back to you guys and answer the question. And please don't forget to uh, like and subscribe. Yep, mm, thank you, have a nice day, see you later.